So I'm here at the Hi! <laughs> it's uh, Mushroom and Shell Phillips right there. Uh, this is the Yukon Quest. They were at the starting line uh, for 2019. And Michelle, what is it, 35 below? Now, do you like it at 35 below or is it a I little... prefer it a little warmer for sure. <laughs> How much warmer? I like about 20, 25 below. Oh yeah, 20, 25. <laughs> that is a good temperature, yeah, I guess. Yeah, exactly. For racing. And why do you like it that cold? Ah, it's just good for humans, good for dogs. Yeah, because yeah. why is it good? Dogs like cold temperatures. Oh. They got coats, they're ready like winter. They do have little, little, little coats. That's nice. So how do you stay warm on the trail? I mean, you've got probably some... I wear a lot of layers. Yeah. Um, I have merino wool to start. Oh yeah? Yeah. Oh, like true fleece merino true wool? True fleece merino like wool, no, super kidding. warm, super soft and awesome. So I'm wearing that as my base layer and then I layer up from there according to the temperatures. Yeah, and do you expect variable temperatures during this race? I mean, yeah, you often see anywhere from um, the 30s to coldest I've seen on this trail is 60 below. 64? 60 below. 60 below? And yeah. what's the warmest you've seen? Uh, I don't know. Over 30s, I don't know. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And that gets kind of difficult because stuff starts to thaw out and makes it tougher to go. Exactly. You get a lot of overflow and stuff like that. How long do you expect to be on the trail for this race uh, this about year? About 10 days. About 10 days, yeah. yeah. Um, and, uh, I don't know. Oh, so you got some True Fleece Merino gear, yep. uh, and how do you like it so far? I like it. It's really comfortable. It's nice and warm and lightweight, and it's great. Yeah? Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah. All right. Well, good luck in the race.